What's up guys, welcome back to Beers and Gears, in today's episode we'll be heading over to Mingle's Auto Repair, and I believe he told me that he was going to be doing lower control arms on his Jeep today, so stay tuned. Well, I was just getting ready to leave to head over to Chad's, and this happens. Battery is not completely dead. But you will not start. So, hammer. <sighs> Starter. Fingers crossed. Nothing. Damn it. The Jeep is not starting. I think the starter crapped out, so it looks like it's back to the Durango. You're always good to me. You are always good to me. still don't understand the Jeep thing. Well, let's continue this little escapade. Today we're going to be switching out the factory lower control arms for a set of tubular rough country control arms. So to start this, you're going to start by removing these 21 millimeter bolts. There's one right here and one right down there. You're also going to want to remove the bottom bolt out of your shock and, brake caliper. and your brake caliper. got the lower control arm in bolted in the back to make this a little easier on yourself you're going to want to unbolt your upper control arm so you can drop your axle down lower that gives you more maneuverability so you can get your lower bolt in the bottom of the lower control arm Okay, so to get these tubular lower control arms in, you disconnected the shock, took the coil spring out. The only reason you need to take the coil spring out is if you're doing spacers, which he is, and disconnected the sway bar end link. That allows your axle to drop low enough to get the bottom bolt in for your lower control arm. You also undid the bolt for the 
the upper control arm. With the bump stops out of the way, the coil spring spacer will slide <laughs> on nicely. Okay, lower control arms are in, coils are back in, and spacers are installed. Say hi, Chad. Beers and gears. Beers and gears. All right, I'm ready when you are. All right, should I get into position? Assume the position. All right. Ready? Whenever I say, like, thanks for watching, guys, I'm Brandon, and then you kick it out, okay? Okay. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm Brandon. And I'm Chad. <laughs> I told you I wanted to smack it pretty hard. I wasn't ready, but that might make for a good outtake. I won't be able to track it, but I'll just grab it and then smash, because that took me a little bit. That was pretty good, though. I'll just hold you. just hold on to your beer, because I'm smacking it. <laughs> full force. Not full force enough to hit the ceiling, but I'm, it's going to be enough. Okay. Uh, ready to do this one more time? Movie star? Alright. Ready? Yep. Okay. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm Brandon. I'm Chad. Beers and gears. <laughs>